In Crime Tracker 10 tonight, a Central Ohio Sheriff's Office is leading the way and even the country on how it's using technology. Crime Tracker 10's Angela Ann takes us to Athens County tonight to show us how your everyday iPad is fighting crime. Captain Brian Cooper doesn't start his workday without a few things. His gun, his badge, and now his iPad. Locate 13 West Washington, Washington Street. Captain Cooper is one of two people in the Athens County Sheriff's Office who developed a new in-cruiser computer system all on the iPad. No more do we have to sit and actually, you know, enter in data to get to where we want. We just touch the app that we want and, and, and it takes us right there. Cooper says the new program does nearly everything similar to traditional mobile data terminals and cruisers, but takes up less space. And with the iPad, deputies can now run photo lineups, conduct interviews. So that's you. Even instantly share strategic locations with the special response team. Sheriff Pat Kelly says the iPad also puts deputies on the road longer. Now the deputies don't have to come back to the office and download their reports. We can do everything that we could do with a computer Just and more. Here's another reason why the sheriff's office says the iPad works so well for them. FaceTime. It's the app that allows people to see and talk to each other for free. Well, it can do the same for law enforcement, taking detectives directly into a crime scene, even if they're miles away. Captain Cooper says a perfect example is meth labs. Deputies can FaceTime the sheriff or a detective right away, saving time and money. Then we can make the determination on, A, do we need the meth guys out there to process the lab? Do we need detectives? Or is that something that the lieutenants and the road units can process themselves? One more plus to the iPad? This saves me about uh, $2,000 per uh, computer. With 16 police cruisers, you do the math. In Athens County, Angela Ann, Crime Tracker 10. And here's a live look at our iPad showing you how the technology can easily be used to show a crime scene. Uh, the sheriff says Athens County is one of a handful of law enforcement agencies across the country using iPads this way. So um, if I could have shown you, we could have shown you how it's pretty useful uh, walking around in the newsroom to show you uh, on the set here how it's supposed to work. Yeah. It was supposed to work, but the problem was I hit something myself and kind of messed it up, and I'm real sad about that because we had the shot. Yeah, well, and that's I wanted live to, there, TV. Wait a minute. There it is. Is that is me? It, it's is showing it myself. That's kind of weird. Ah, there you go. Um, I need to get it the other way around, <laughs> so though. So if you turn it around, Let's yeah. see if I turn it if around. If we turn it around, we'll see the weather will center, we see, right? Will we see the... Okay, yes, we see you. There, there. there Hello. we go. Hi. Hello. And uh, the weather center down there, but that's not Chris Bradley. That isn't Chris. Where is Chris? That's Michael. Hey, hey. Michael. Hey. <laughs> hey. 